The calendar feature allows you to schedule the playback of presentations. To schedule a calendar event, let's go to View and down to Calendar. Currently, you'll see that there's no event scheduled. We can add a calendar event by hitting the Add icon. Let's call this Auto Start. And then below there, you can see the actual schedule for this calendar event. If you wanted to do a one-time event, you would simply just change the date and time to whatever day and time you want to trigger a presentation or playlist to auto start. But if you want to do this on a regular basis, we can choose to repeat. So I'm going to set up my announcement loop to auto play every Sunday morning at 8 a.m. so no one ever forgets to start it. And now you'll see all of the upcoming auto start events that are happening in our calendar. Now, if you don't want to see all the future ones, we can just toggle it off by clicking this button. You can also set an end date so it only happens for a specific amount of time. But currently, this isn't doing anything. We need to set up an action for our actual scheduled event. So here's where we select a either playlist or a presentation inside of a playlist to automatically start. I'm going to choose my announcement loop and you'll notice that a new calendar icon that showed up next to our playlist noting that there's a calendar event associated with this playlist. Now instead of waiting for that calendar event to actually happen to see if it works, we can simply just click the test button. And now our announcement loop has started with this two second timer and it's going to happen every single Sunday at 8 a.m.